Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to episode 405 of Hopped Up Gaming East. I will be your host on this podcast about beer, video games, and everything in between. But it's not just me you're going to listen to this week. I've brought along a couple of friends. Let's go around the old beer table podcasting square here and introduce everyone. I've got the beneficial Ben. Always good to have one of those on the show. I see you're warming up your stretches for your match of the batch pitch already. Yep. You got to just make sure your vocabulary is limber and delightful. Delightful? Well, that's being limber and delightful is what Dexterous Dylan is good at. Hi, Dylan. Delightful Dylan would have been even better, but I am also here with whatever name you give me. And you know what? You can't make a square wooden table without a little bit of tremendous timber tim welcome to the show tim you're you're i'd say you're rock solid but you're you're more of a, made of wood according to my alliteration yeah i just... thought for sure <laughs> it was going to be treacherous tim that would be much better wouldn't that would have been better this tim this would require <laughs> the kind of foresight that i cannot manifest in my life because i am mismanaged matthew <laughs> i cannot fucking find the time to do anything right ever instead though i find ways to make fucked up solutions and before we get into match of the batch this week uh i promised you last week a fucked up solution for an ongoing problem in this show so if you'll give me one second ladies and no. gentlemen we've had a he did fucking wheel on this show yeah but oh he did. my oh. god oh, oh. Boys and girls, what? Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yes! So we've made a wheel! I've made Dude, a fucking wheel! I and love it. Walk, walk us through this bad Sally. So we've, oh got, my God. we've got a wheel, and it actually works. This is a prototype. Uh, it's barely holding together. Uh, the idea is that if we ever <laughs> encounter a problem, like, ah, oh, fuck, two people are in last place or in first place, well, we'll just have the wheel fall from the sky like it just did, and we'll give it a quick spin, and whatever it lands on is the tie-breaking method. Uh, and I just, think Evan wins. <laughs> yes, so uh, there are several pie slices on this janky wheel, and I'll just quickly go through them for our audio audience here. Uh, first up, we have flip a coin. Fairly simple, just flip a coin. Uh, next up, we've got biggest beer in milliliters wins. Next up, we have end the show immediately. Uh, don't want to land on that one. That leaves things <laughs> up in the air still. Uh, just a little bit of a, you know, like the Wheel of Fortune, you get bankrupt. You fuck the whole thing up. Yeah. <laughs> uh, next up, Ben asks a trivia question. Fairly simple. Now, we'll run into problems when Ben is part of the equation, but we'll figure it out. There's pick a number between 1 and 10. That'll be also kind of dealt with whoever is uh, not participating. Uh, host's choice. A very powerful one if that comes up and the host is participating. Uh, smallest beers in milliliters. Uh... You know, you know, to complement biggest beer. So there's not just a bias of buying the biggest beer every week, just in case it goes to a tie. Uh, and then we have uh, probably the most intriguing one on the list. We have Evan wins. Uh, so that'll just end up marking everyone who's tied as second place, and then Evan takes the win. What if we have a three-way tie? Spin the wheel, Evan baby. Wins. Evan wins. Flip a coin. Flip a coin three times. Uh, hey, it can land on the fucking side. There's a lot of side on that thing. So what? What if we all bring a one liter Grolsch? We can dream. Yeah. Well, if you all do that, then you got bigger problems than this wheel not having a result it can spit out that determines a winner. I love I mean, it. Thank you, Matt. I cannot wait for the subsequent wheels that need to decide the tiebreaker issues that come up with some of these wheel results. This is yes, I. We're going to be doing wheels upon wheels, wheels upon games upon scavenger hunts to solve any problems. So uh, was there a problem we needed to solve from an ongoing untie broken event recently? Was there is Star Fox is Star Fox bad or did Matt win? Well, last week we had a tie. So we had a tie we last week. That's last right. Week. Well, why don't we test yeah. the wheel this week then with... What was the last week's beers that are under contention? It was... It was Dylan's and yours. What was the category? Um, I can't remember. Shit all. I made a wheel. This turtles. Uh, turtles. Turtles. Yes. You brought the Seven Years Pale Ale. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure what that 
was it takes seven years turtle? to watch Cape Breton as a turtle. Oh God, how did that tie? Oh right, you had a puppet. That's yeah. why. A puppet uh, and, from and, help. Yeah. Yeah. Dylan made a mix of a pecan pie porter and a double chocolate stout to okay. stimulate the turtle's chocolate candy. Well, guys, if you don't mind, can I have the inaugural spin here to determine who is the winner of those two beers? It's going to be. I'm not sure how choice. anyone else would spin it. So you yes. have here to. we go, baby. <laughs> Hit that Woo! wheel. Oh my God! It's been oh, beautiful, that's Matthew. Good spin. That's a great spin. End the show well, immediately! Yeah. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for Hopped Up Gaming East episode 405. We're going to see you next week. Thank you for listening. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.